67,000 followers in eight days. That is what happened from just one of my TikTok videos. But that didn't happen the first time I posted the video. I had to learn the strategies, the techniques for creating successful TikTok videos. And today, this is what I'm gonna teach you. Today I'll be sharing my TikTok process from recording to publishing to actually optimizing my TikTok videos. And be sure to stick around to the end. I'll be sharing my favorite tip on what to do when you just have a day when you can't create content. So let's get into my recording process. One of the first things I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to my favorites. Now my favorites is where I've found videos that I can kind of put my business spin on it when I actually recreate the video. So in this example, this is a young lady who's going about her day and she's having these moments where her brain reminds her of things that she doesn't want to remember. I decided that I was going to do the exact same thing except flipping it for my business. So what I'm going to need to do is click on the video, then click on the sound and then click on use sound. And then I begin to record my actual video. So what I'm doing here is I'm recording the video into bite-sized pieces. Then I go into the editing phase where I'm adding text to match up with every single chunk of the video. So the next thing I do is I write a captivating caption. Just because you have an amazing video doesn't mean that someone's going to watch it. But one of the number one ways to get people to watch it is what you put in the caption. So I typically will write something funny or something extremely relatable that will cause a person to want to say, let me at least tap on this video and see what it's about. So for this video, I may write something like when your brain is in overdrive because it's funny and it's relatable for people that know that their brain is always, always moving. So now this is where you're going to add your hashtags. I'm looking for hashtags in my niche also that fit this particular video. And because this video is all about entrepreneur life and the entrepreneur brain, we're going to use hashtags around entrepreneurs. So I started to write the word entrepreneurs and you can see how many views are on a video. Video. So it may say 11.4 B that's 11.4 billion views. And I'm looking for hashtags that have 300,000 up to one to 2 million views on them. And so I kept scrolling until I found hashtags with less than 2 million views on them. Once I was done with particular hashtags, I chose new ones. So then I went to new biz or new business owner. And I chose a couple of those that had less than 2 million views on them. Once I kept going and I reached the 150 character limit, I got a notification that I had hit my max and I had to stop there. So once you finish your hashtags and you see your video in the upper right hand corner, this is where you're able to choose the cover for your actual video. But in addition to that, you can write a text cover to go on top of it as well. My text cover is crazy brain. And so if someone is scrolling through the for you page or on your page, they can see this certain cover. So having a cover on your video is going to give people a reason to click it, even if they haven't seen the caption yet. Yet. So you saved your video to drafts, but now you're ready to publish. All you want to do is go back to your home screen and click on the section that says drafts. Once you find the video that you want to publish, you click on that video. So in that section below, make sure everything is green. Make sure it says everyone can view it. Everyone can comment, stitch, duet, and that it was saved to your device. Once all of that is green, you're ready to publish, hit the little red box at the bottom, publish, and now your video is going live on TikTok. So now you may be asking, when should you actually publish your videos? Well, it depends. If you are trying to publish a video and reach people that already follow you, then you want to go and check your analytics and you want to post about one hour before your typical follower is on TikTok. For more about that, click the link in the description and you can watch a video all about that. If you're trying to publish a video to hit the for you page to reach new people, then you want to think about what are times that people are normally on social media, probably in the morning and afternoon and late evening would be great times to publish your TikTok videos. Now for my bonus. If you ever have a day when you're not going to be able to create TikTok content, here's all you have to do. Go and find a video on your profile that did really well. If you have a viral video, this is the perfect one. Go back to that old video, save it to your phone and re upload that same video to TikTok. Now, 
ninja trick. You can't just upload it that way. You've got to find the old uh, sound that goes with the video and you've got to attach that sound to the video because it will go viral again by using the sound that's already on TikTok. Otherwise, it's like you re-uploading a new video. If you want to learn how to add a sound to your video, we talk about it in this video right here. But if you also want to learn how to use your TikTok content on other social media platforms, click this link right here. I'll see you on the next video.